Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh. Welcome every student to this new lesson. Today we have vocabulary, grammar, and the name of the course is Traveler 5. This is from Unit 5. We are in the first semester and we are targeting third secondary stage. Okay, what we will learn today, as you can see, number one, identify collocations with set. To learn how to refer to the future using appropriate tenses. And three, identify words easily confused. Okay, so identifying collocations with the word set, learning how to refer to the future using appropriate tenses, and identifying words easily confused. This is the warm up page, and the question for you What do you think the future will be? Welcome to the future. What do you think the future will be? Is there anything going to be changed, for example, in these cities or in terms of uh, transportations? All right, collocations with sit. Here we go with some examples. Number one, have you set a date for your wedding yet? He hasn't set a price for his car, has he? It is important to set a goal for yourself so you have something to work towards. And the fourth sentence, I forget to set the clock when the time changed, so now it's an hour behind. And as you can see, set up, set the agenda, set, set aside, and set the rules. Those are the collocations with the word set. Here we go with the exercise. Complete the sentences with the word in the box. We have four, senten four sentences and we have four words. All right, the word is task, trap, standards, and example. Number one, I don't think you set a good for your little brother, you know. Nice set uh, for the mouse last night, but it is not in uh, there yet. And three, the teacher set the for the student, we sit high and expect a lot from our employees. Okay, those are the right answers. Complete the sentences with the words in the box. As you can see, I don't think you set a good task for your little brother, you know. I set a trap for the mouse last night, but isn't in there yet. The teacher set an example. So for the student, we set high standards and expect a lot from our employees. Words easily confused. Use the correct form of the words in the box to complete the sentences. Habitat, home, house, residence. Uh, Abdul has boat in the countryside. I want to stop and get some dinner before we go. Where is the location of your... Now, I believe wild animals should live in their natural, not in zoos. Okay, Abdul has boat house in the countryside. I want to stop and get some dinner before we go home. Where is the location of your residence, sir? And I believe wild animals should live in their natural habitat, not in zoos. All right, future forms. As you can see, we have future going to, as you know, and future will. And for some certain cases, there is future for the present progressive, which is planned activities already arranged. While going to, we use it for future plans and intentions, and as well as predictions, objective, real evidence, while in well we should use it unplanned future decided at the moment we've even of speaking uh, predictions not real evidence also in the promises through its offers we are going to take it in more details in the next slide all right the future well is used as you can see to make predictions, usually with perhaps 
or after the verbs believe, think, hope, expect, be sure, etc. She'll probably be here tomorrow. And also to talk about spontaneous decision, we've run out of milk. I'll go to and I'll go and buy some. And also we use will for the promises. I'll be on time. Don't worry. So for prediction, decision, and promise, we use well as you can see. And also we use the future going to to talk about future plans. My brother is going to study biology and also to make predictions based on evidence. Look out, you are going to trip over that chair. while in the present progressive is used for planned future actions related to personal arrangements. I am traveling to London tomorrow. As you can see this chart explaining this tense, the present progressive is used to plan future actions related to personal arrangements. And we have an exercise, read the dialogues and I'll circle the correct words. A. Where are you going? Do you go on holiday next summer? B. I'll probably go. Um, about to go to Cyprus. Two. Will you move? Do you move? How soon? Yes, I move. Will move as soon as they finish. Will finish painting the house. The right answer for each. Where are you going on holiday next summer? I'll be probably. I'll probably go to Cyprus. And will you move? How soon? Yes, I'll move as soon as they finish the painting, uh, painting the house. In the future forms, you can see the future progressive is used to talk about actions that will be progress at specific time in the future. At nine o'clock tomorrow, he'll be flying to Egypt. The future perfect progressive is used to show the duration of an action up to a certain point of time in the future. The action may continue further. By midnight, we will have been flying for seven hours. In the future form, as you can see, future symbol, future progressive, future perfect progressive, and future perfect uh, and present symbol, uh, future meaning, and present progressive future meaning and be going to time for the assessment circle the correct answer Hassan will have worked will be working over time for a few days I hope I will have interviewing will have interviewed all people by the time the manager arrives will arrive Eric can't come to the phone now he is about leave will leave for his Spanish lesson. Tony thinks that Tigers will probably win. Will probably be winning the cup final. And the fifth sentence: Stop doing that puzzle, Jim. By 11:30, you will be working. Will have been working on it for six hours. He doesn't like Jalen, so he will not have invited. Is it going to invite him to his? house next Saturday. The right answers for each. Hassan will be working. I hope I will have interviewed Eric leave and Tony when stop doing that puzzle. Jim by 11.30 you will have been working. He doesn't like going so he isn't going to invite him. What we have learned as you can see on this the forms of the future and also collocations with the word sit, sit up, sit the edge of the sit, sit aside, sit the rules, and also words easily confused like habitat, home, house, and residence. Those were the references, and this line, as usual, means the end of the lesson. I would like to thank you for re watching. I hope you do I enjoy and learn something new from this lesson. For more information, at listen, please visit our website or you can contact us via twitter account if you prefer to call this is the right number eight zero zero four four two 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 zero 
Thank you again. Hope to see you next time. Until that, goodbye for now.